Oh my god, time for a new blog. Today is Wednesday, the 24th of March, and I think there's a new South Park episode on tonight. Oh, <laughs> today just keeps getting better and better. First of all, this is a new pair of Oakleys, or not, you know, a new pair, but it's one of my pairs of Oakleys. These were actually my first pair of Oakleys ever. These are very similar to the ones you guys saw yesterday, the M-Frames, but they are not the carbon fiber ones. Anyways, a lot of shit that I gotta go over right now. Uh, RuneScape shit is basically... 406,000 experience till 89 smithing. <laughs> Hooray! Still in creation, I want to do tonight, and I will do tonight, so if you motherfuckers see this video in like the next two, three hours from now, then, you know, I'll be in my clan chat, and we can do still in creations. Hooray! Another thing that I want to blog about, though, is right now I, I just uploaded a new video on my main channel, uh, Bounty Hunter 8, uh, Staff of Light. Yes, I will be making a PvP video with the almighty Staff of Light, and it might, you know, suck balls, but it's going to happen. I will make a PvP video soon. Anyways, the annotation on videos. Now, you guys need to let me know. You know when you upload a video on YouTube, how you click my videos and it says, you know, an annotations. You can add annotations or shit like that. Well, the, the motherfuckers, I, I can't add an annotator. Oh, God damn it. Like, I'm trying to add an annotation on my video. And it says error connecting unable to reach a uh, reach the, the unable to reach the server and it does it's been YouTube has been like this for the past like it it's been doing this for the past week like I tried to add an annotation click here to see something and it'll say error connecting I'm like what the fuck is wrong with you so if you guys have the same issue or problem let me know so I'm just not you know the only one that I think maybe I'm losing it because this is poor shit. A little update, basically I told you that I'm experimenting with some merchanting items on free play. Uh, I still am. Uh, past like day I made like a 300k profit, so <laughs> it really isn't that good. But, th but then again, 300k if we're just pressing some buttons and inserting items and taking items out of the GE, I guess that's pretty good, you know. It's better than 500k in two weeks, I can let you, you know, tell you that. But then again, free play merchanting, you know, the items you buy in free play, they don't have a big difference between the lowest price and the biggest price. Like, for example, I used to use God Swords as member, member items, right? Just, you know, use God Swords. They're the easiest thing. Well, God Swords don't really, are not stable right now because they drop by 500k or, like, they drop, you know, by large amounts. And that's not good. So... Any item that really has a, a big difference from the lowest to the highest by a couple mil, that's a good item to use. But free play, there's really no really good free play items. It's, you know, shitty. And it sucks. <laughs> Money making sucks. Damn it. A lot of people have been asking what I'm doing for 50,000 subscribers. I just hit like 52k like today or yesterday early in the morning. And I know that I said I would make a special 50k subscribers video. Um, it, it sort of caught me like off balance because I, I want to make, I still, I will, but it, it's one of those things that it just caught me off balance because I really didn't keep keep up with it and I really, you know, I had thing, other things going on. So it really, you know, just caught, sort of caught me off balance. But I will probably be making it very shortly, um, maybe in later, well, probably maybe start filming it this weekend because it's not going to be just one of those you know cheesy videos it's actually going to be like some time with filming and stuff like that and the good thing about filming or filming taking a while is that you know the videos they come out good but it just takes a while because you gotta get a film editing really isn't that bad as, as you guys know i really don't spend that much time editing in my videos <laughs> i really don't but it's more so the fact that sometimes getting the film is a bitch rather than, you know, actually editing. For some people, editing is a bitch rather than getting the film. Me, filming is sometimes a bitch, but editing really isn't. So, you know, sort of opposites with me. I want to read off uh, some questions I got from, once again, you can email me, asknightmarerh at yahoo.com. Uh, basically, any questions you have r related to RuneScape. This question, hey mate, 
uh, exclamation mark. I'm currently combat level 131 on RuneScape, so my question is kind of newbie, you know, smiley face. Anyways, how did you get your first 100 mil? Take care, slash slash, David. Well, David, my first 100 mil just basically came from... A lot of it came from merchanting pure, uh, pure essence, when you could merchant pure essence. Like, what I did was basically, you know, I would buy them from people and then go on the forums and sell them for a higher price. Buy them cheap from people on RuneScape, and then I would go on the forums and sell them for a higher price, where you can't do that anymore. But then again, I made my first probably 100 mil from fishing, sharks, uh, let me see, what else I did? I did some fletching, um some combat, uh, just Anku, shit like that, I don't know, just really stuff like that, I mean, my first money guide ever that I have on my main channel is really what I did to 120 mil, but that's really all I really did, but if you're at combat level 131, camp at dragons, and make like 400k an hour, that, that's really all you need to do, David. Next question, this person writes, oh my god, time for a new letter, I'm a big fan, sexy smiley face. In a vid, you said that you did a lot of bosses once, like KBD and other shit like that. I want to know what level you recommend for doing Bandos and other shit bosses in the God Wars dungeon. And slash or would you recommend doing it for money? Smiley face. RS name, Magic Supper. But it's Magic S-V-U-P-P-E-R. Listen, I'm horrible with, with names, you know, it's just, it's one, it's just not my thing, so, oh well, anyways, I did do bosses like KBD and uh, KQ, although I really never did them that much, as for what level do I recommend going there, it's more so, not so much on your level, I don't really think, I think it more or less matters about your combat skills, you know, God Wars, you know, Bandos can hit high levels on you, I know that, that if you're a tanker, he can butt hump you, so having a high HP level, you know, it's one of those things, like, I'm a level 115 on RuneScape, and my combat skills are kind of shitty, but I can survive at God Wars if I have a good team, so therefore, it's really, use your own judgment, but, would I recommend it doing for money? Yes, there are people who have a 1.5 bill bank, or a 2 bill bank on RuneScape, who all they, all they did was just camp at God Wars. You camp out, you stay at God Wars for months, you will make money. You go maybe once or twice a week, you're not making any money. You're probably losing money. So, or unless you get really, really lucky. So, my suggestion is, just if you want to go to God Wars for money, just go there and stay there forever. And never leave the fucking place. Stay there for eternity, damn it, and you'll be the richest person on RuneScape. Oh my god. To really sum this blog up, yes, ACDC shirt, as you can see, I do actually like ACDC. I don't really know why, since their new album, and it's kind of iffy, but some of ACDC songs are actually kind of good. But, anyways, to sum this blog really up, hopefully I'll be close to 98 tonight for smithing, but I do want to play some SC, so look out, you know, in my clan chat uh, for that shit. Uh, otherwise, let me know by either a message, comment on my channel, comment on this video if you guys are having YouTube problems with adding annotations to your videos because it's actually pissing me off right now. So, otherwise, see you guys tomorrow. And once again, leave your nasty, dear little comments, and thanks for subscribing.